Hatayat Khamisa is considered one of the most fertile lands in Siwa and has the best types of olive gardens that produce the best quality of olives. It's famous for other crops too, and in spite of that, the rich landowners of the village do not live in it, but on houses in the city. As for the houses that exist in Hamisa, they belong to the workers. The village is called Hamisa, after a queen who's supposed to have ruled the oasis, and the legend goes that she owned a treasure and that it was hidden somewhere at the edges of the garden at a hill called Hamisa II. According to the manuscript of Siwa, which contains the local history of the oasis and was written in 1883, there were 30 springs in Hamisa. But what remained usable are very few. Besides, its water is wasted as it pours in the salty lakes of Hamisa and El Maraki. Most of these springs are old and filled with sand, but it seemed that this land remained prosperous after the Roman period. In the 15th century, the famous historian Il Makrizi described this area to be vast countries that comprise a big number of palm trees and fertile lands and water springs. In 1950, the government started to clean and purify the old springs in this area, which were filled with sand. The purpose was to start an experimental project to reclaim the land and dry part of the salty lakes of Hamisa and Maraki, but unfortunately, the project stopped. <laughs> 